Hey everybody, it's Brandon. It's Brandy. Uh, so, a lot of shit. I got a new Mac and a new fancy microphone and some instruments and stuff is happening. Um, subscribe to my other channel. It's called Eyes of Resistance, but don't leave here. And yeah, so shit's coming, but I'm the biggest hypocrite of 2016 because, uh, you know, I didn't really do much as far as this channel goes. Uh, got some lists coming too, best of, worst of, music, movies lists. So look forward to that. And uh, let's, uh, let's just watch a couple trailers and talk about how Spider-Man and all the Marvel movies uh, look like Spotlight. So let's do that. Don't you just love how, how they all have to do this? Like, the brah, the Inception shit, like... They were saying this was gonna be like a John Hughes teen comedy. And it's has the Inception shit. And they all have the Inception shit. <sighs> okay. Let's, let's keep going. What's up, guys? Wait a minute. You guys aren't the real Avengers. Ha! I get it. Because they all have the masks on. Like, the guy in the right is wearing the Iron Man mask. And then they have, like, Captain America and Thor and the Hulk. But they're robbing a bank. Honestly, like, this type of quippiness pisses me off in the Marvel movies, and it made me really mad when I was watching this. The thing is, with Spider-Man, they kind of get an out, because this is, like, the one time that the, the, the horrible Marvel quip shit can actually work. Because it's Spider-Man, and he does this kind of stuff. So, honestly, like, I, I know I'm, like, anti-Marvel and, and all that, um, not that I'm pro DC, this isn't, this, this isn't one of those videos. Just saying, generally I'm against this, and I was against it when this first played, but, uh, you know, this is like the third time I'm watching this, and, uh, it doesn't bother me as much. Tom Holland seems like he's gonna be, uh, okay in this movie. I liked him in Civil War. Um, but yeah. This looks like Spotlight so far. I can tell Hulk gives it away. Oh, that was awesome. All right, yeah. Now I can give that a year. I can give that a, a sort of year. MGMT, Time to Pretend, it's a great song. Uh, you know, I, I really hope he doesn't do that all the time though. I really hope he doesn't say, this is awesome, like 30 times, because he did that in Civil War. And that was kind of the one time where I was like, okay, awesome. Like, let's not, let's not use awesome all the time because, oh, teenagers, they're like, hey, that was awesome. I don't know why I use that accent, but uh, that's, you know, that's just not really how uh, kids talk. I don't think they, they know what they're doing over here. Uh, but yeah, cool song choice. This is the, the teen vibe. I'll give you this one. Uh, all right, let's let let's let's see what you got. Does Liz get a new top? No, we've seen that before. Never with that skirt. She probably stops staring before it gets creepy, though. Yeah. Too late. You guys are losers. Okay, so uh, to elaborate on the spotlight thing, um, I don't think I've talked about it on this channel before, except maybe in my, my Deadpool video. It's not that these movies look like Spotlight. I, I get that they're not about rape, technically, even though all, all the Marvel movies I see, like Doctor Strange, really do simulate what, what I imagine like a very harsh rape would be. Um, and they're not about priests raping kids. I understand that. Uh, but visually, 
they're just not inventive. Like they have the biggest budgets in the world and they still manage to make their big tentpole movies look like cheap TV shows. Like the aesthetic of all this stuff is just not pleasing. I get that they're just sitting in a room. They're sitting at a cafeteria table, but there's nothing cinematic looking. They, they always use these just really static shots. Just, Oh, let's let me just shoot. Let's just shoot the characters. It, it all came from the first Avengers movie. Like it's a good, it's a really good movie. The first Avengers, but it looks not the best. Um, and that's just kind of the the pattern because they want to make every movie because it's in the Marvel Cinematic Universe. They want to make it all look samey. And it just makes for really boring looking movies. Uh, as far as this little bit in the trailer, not terrible. Again, I, I found this more egregious and not funny when I first watched it. But Tom Holland, the more, the more I look at this, it's Tom Holland. I mean, he's selling me on it. I like his little reaction here. I don't like his weird fat friend here he looks like he might annoy me but uh yeah i, I i'm not mad at this I'm not mad at this moment so to become an avenger are there like trials or an interview just don't do anything i would do and definitely don't do anything i wouldn't do there's a little gray area in there and that's where you operate <laughs> uh yeah th this is this is fine too i'm all right with this because one of the uh, the strongest aspects of having Spider-Man in the Civil War movie was uh, his interactions with with Tony Stark. They had a good uh, they had a good back and forth, and it looks like it's carrying over here. Uh, yeah, this is a this is a nice this is a nice little moment. Does look like spotlight. Does look like uh, you know someone's around the corner looking to rape. But besides that, it's. Uh, yeah, not bad. Not bad so far. Oh. All right. It's not a hug. I'm just grabbing the door for you. All right, kid. Good luck out there. I'm rough, I'm Listen, I know school sucks. Spotlight. Spotlight. Peter, you still with us? Uh, yeah, yeah. I know you want to save the world, but you're not ready yet. You're the Spider-Man. No, I'm not. I'm not. This is just a costume. Okay, to me, this guy looks like right now, like he was just jacking off to like videos of cats or something. And then Tom Holland just comes in and he's like, oh, oh, oh. And he's like, oh no, he found me. Cats, I'm looking at pictures of cats and jacking off right now. And also my friend is Spider-Man. That's, that's really all I'm getting. I really don't like this guy. I don't like his face. And I don't like the way his eyes are in this shot. Like, it, it honestly is bothering me that his eyes are looking like this. So. And this is from the ceiling. Stay close to the ground. And stay out of trouble. Ugh. Why? We couldn't, we just couldn't have fun for an entire trailer. We were having fun, we were in high school, and things were nice, and we just couldn't have fun. It's back to the Inception music. Back to the bombs. I thought we were done with this. We had this at the beginning, and I thought, great, let's, now we transition into the fun part. Why, why couldn't they have put this in with the rest of it like if the whole spirit that you're going for with this movie is it's like hey he's spider-man and he's having fun which is how it's supposed to be even when he's he's going against his villains and i thought they actually did a pretty remarkable job of that in the amazing spider-man 2 it's not that's not what, that's not what you're doing here we couldn't just put this stuff in with time to pretend like oh here's the here's the big baddie it's vulture and it's still fun though, because he's Spider Man and he's swinging around. Nope, it all it's all serious now. Now it's serious spotlight. It's spotlight dark. Like Justice League Dark. It's spotlight dark. Here we go. It's gonna be intense now, and you gotta be tense because of this robot bird. 
Michael Keaton is in this, so that's cool. But it's a robot bird, and I'm not I'm not scared, and I don't feel tense looking at this. And is it looks like he's wearing a fur coat. I know that's what the vulture looks like. Okay, I'm I'm a Spider Man fan. I know this guy. But like, ah, oh, Jesus. Just look at this, and think about the music that's playing, and just how sad it is that that this has to happen. Forget the flying monster guy. There are people who handle this sort of thing. I'm sick of him treating me like a kid all the time. But you are a kid. This is my chance to prove myself. Peter, what is going on with you? I'm really sorry. I'm so busy. I'm slammed. Oh, God. Oh, is, is this a pun? Because he said he's getting slammed and then he's getting slammed to a bus. Jesus. Don't mess with me, because I will kill you and everybody you love. All right. Well, that's that, I guess. Uh, well, like I said before, beginning of this trailer, it's grown on me, and... and I am going to buy into Tom Holland, even though I think Tobey Maguire was great. Andrew Garfield was even better. And I don't think Tom Holland is as good as Andrew Garfield so far with what we've seen of him. Um, he is selling me here, but I, I just, I really don't like that they had to turn this trailer into that. And it looks like Spotlight. So, eh, you know. Sorry if this video is annoying because you want everyone to be excited for every Marvel movie because they're just they're just the best and they just they they make all of my nostalgic dreams come true and I just love I just love shared cinematic universes so much and that they're just doing such a great job and uh, I'm sorry but uh yeah just this just isn't um it's just not my thing so far. And I love Spider-Man. He's my favorite superhero. So I am, as usual, with all these movies, I thought Amazing Spider-Man 2 looked terrible. And, and uh, you know, I ended up really enjoying that movie. So I, I want this to be good. I do. And I'm hoping for the best. Anyway... Uh, oh yeah, there's like, there's like one more thing after this. Uh, it's like Spider-Man and Iron Man f flying around the city together. I don't, I don't give a shit. Thanks for watching. I will talk to you soon, everybody. Um, subscribe to my other channel. It's called Eyes of Resistance, but don't leave here. And yeah, so shit's coming, but I'm the biggest hypocrite of 2016 because... Uh, you know, I didn't really do much as far as this channel goes. Uh, got some lists coming too. Best of, worst of, music, movies lists. So, look forward to that. You guys aren't the real Avengers. Ha! I get it. Because they all have the masks on. Like, the guy in the right is wearing the Iron Man mask, and then they have, like, Captain America and Thor and the Hulk, but they're robbing a bank. Honestly, like, mean comedy, and it has the Inception shit, and they all have the Inception shit. <sighs> okay, let's, let's keep going. What's up, guys? Wait a minute. And uh, let's uh, let's just watch a couple trailers and talk about how Spider-Man and all the Marvel movies uh, look like Spotlight. So let's do that. <sighs> Don't you just love how how they all have to do this? Like the bra, the Inception shit. Like 
they were saying this was going to be like a John Hughes team. Hey everybody, it's Brandon. It's Brandy. Uh, so, a lot of shit. I got a new Mac and a new fancy microphone and some instruments and stuff is happening. 